So first, thank you so much for coming and sharing your film with us. Uh, first question, do you ever wish you had some of those poison darts uh, to use? <laughs> I've been playing with things like that since I was in elementary school. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great. I'm sure they come in handy. <laughs> So I think um, most people associate with uh, you with uh, contemporary uh, stories, uh, whether or not it's a horror film uh, or a Kotaro Isaka adaptation um, or a thriller. Um, so I'm curious about what made you uh, make this turn towards Jidaigeki uh, with your previous film, uh, Magnificent Nine, um, as well as uh, this film, Mumon. あの、いろいろ本読んだり、こういうお話やりませんかって様々なジャンルで言ってくれるプロデューサーたちがいるので、まずそれがありがたいことですね、1点が。First I have been getting a lot of offers for Jidaigeki historical dramas. So that's the first turning point. で、例えば今回の映画だったら、あの、ninja And for this film just as the ninja becomes in the modern times. で、原作のその小説がその最後のラストページにそれが書いてあるんですよね。In the last page of the original novel that's what's written. の日本人ってこういうお金が一番だったり嘘ばっかりついてたりっていう人も僕の知り合いにはいたりするなというのが。There are a lot of people around me who just like the character characters towards the end do only think about money. アメリカはわかんないですけどね。Not sure about in America, but 日本は。僕はそういう嘘ばっかりついてたり、そのお金、お金言ってくるの、まあ僕3人ぐらい知ってるんですけど。I know about 3 people around me who only think about money. みんなプロデューサーですけどね。They're all producers. だそういうあの大事なことっていうのを伝えたいことっていうのがあると引き受けるので、逆にジャンルはそれでバラバラになっちゃうんですよね。so for me, it doesn't really matter what genre it is, as long as the core idea is something that speaks to me. I understand. Um, I think one of these, uh, one of the distinctive features uh, of your films uh, is that you want to pack a lot of a range of emotions in. Uh, and in this film, you'll have a very, very silly scene where Mumon is basically doing a kind of exercise routine uh, while uh, people are trying to attack him with spears. And then one of the most kind of heartbreaking scenes uh, in the film where his uh, you know, wife is killed by these uh, poison darts. Um, so I wonder if you could just comment on just the range of emotions that you uh, include in your films. Because I think other filmmakers would want to have a dramatic film or a tragedy, but you want to make every kind of film in one movie. It's very hard yeah. for me too, to make that kind of film. コントロールはしたんですけど、自分でやっぱりカントロールしてるんだけど、本当にうまくいくかなって不安でいっぱいでやってましたね。I need to try and un unless I can't see unless I try and I try to control it as a director, but it's really hard to balance those emotions. 特にやっぱり主人公が本気になったら一瞬で映画が終わっちゃうので。uh, in particular, once the protagonist becomes serious, then the whole movie is over. So I had to make sure that I had to balance that humor. Great. Um, and I noticed that uh, both in your uh, previous film, Magnificent Nine, 
and Mumon. Money is very important. Magnificent Nine is really just all about kind of taxes, right? Yeah, no, no, no. Right, exactly. And we kind of uh, learn, learn the difference that, oh, she's not just interested in money, but she's interested in him uh, kind of taking responsibility. Uh, and how, how did you kind of focus in on this, uh, this theme um, for, for the film uh, as uh, the, the lesson that Mumon uh, ends up learning? Because it kind of sneaks up on you. There's always talk of money recently, so it's kind of coincidental. Great. Yeah, I think it's a way uh, that uh, the film uh, kind of connects to uh, you know the, the, the zeitgeist uh, of the time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, so I think we have a lot of questions uh, from uh, the audience, uh, people who are familiar uh, with some of your uh, other films, uh, as well as uh, based on uh, the film we just saw tonight. So we have uh, two microphones on either side of the auditorium. Uh, and if you do have a question, pre please raise your hand and we'll bring the microphone over to you. I think the first hand was over here with Christina. Uh, I've been a very big fan for a long time. Um, uh, attending festivals here in the U.S., uh, your work is often uh, the audience favorite and one talked about long after the festival is over. And one of the largest complaints uh, that I hear is that we can't find your work outside of the festival space. Is there a plan to release uh, more of your films on DVD or streaming or anything where American audiences uh, can access them? I'll tell my producer. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Thank you. Sorry. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, I mean, generating generating buzz, you know, hope, will hopefully uh, create 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 more of that draw, and that's part of what we're trying to do here as well. Um, I see a hand over here on this side. If we could bring the microphone. Uh, good evening. First, welcome to New York City. Thank you very much for visiting. So I had a question, very interesting part, given particularly today's uh, issues, not only in the U.S. but even in the region, in Japan and China, that you're talking about material wealth in terms of money, but Pride and nationalism, which is what his wife tried to instill on him to protect the land, is also can be construed as materialism, right? That can produce also negative uh, actions. Is that something that was thought of, or just, I mean, was that just something that came out in, in a film as a counterbalance to, to, uh, mater to say, monetary wealth? But I'm looking at pride and nationalism as also being materialistic things that in today's world is becoming very negative and destructive. Uh, so you think pride and nationalism is a positive? うん、あの、やっぱり国を自分の国を守るのにお金をくれっていうセリフがあって、それは多分今多分どの国でもそんなこと言うはずないし、っていうあたりのうん一番なんかそそこのそこで違和感を感じおかしいなと思ってくれた
Uh, I think nowadays no one is really saying, give me money and I'll protect the country. So I'm hoping that's something that you will feel is odd or uncomfortable in this film. Um, so I do hope that you will feel that the pride and nationalism of is is not as good of a factor in the film, and that the ninjas, the reason, one of the reasons why they're not depicted as very cool ninjas, is because of of that uh, factor. Yeah, I think yeah, it's it's an interesting uh, question. I think the film brings out those tensions uh, in a really fascinating way, uh, especially given the historical time period and the Sengoku uh, Warring States time, when the the na question of a nation almost doesn't exist. Great. Um, uh, do we have any more uh, questions uh, from the audience? Uh, maybe up here in the front. ものすごく面白くて、<笑> It was very interesting. It's the first uh, in a while that I've seen such an interesting film. But my question is why you chose Ono Satoshi for the protagonist. Um, it's a very interesting choice. But also the music. There's a question about the music as well. あの、ほん、ほんとだらこれぐらい欲しいけど、もっと全然十分の1 <笑> マネが、マネがそれでこう、だと。でも、ま、一つで、あともう一つは僕、その大野 <笑> So the first reason why I chose Ono is because uh, even if it's really hard to fundraise for film, for war movies where you need a lot of money for the, the battle scenes, you can't go below a certain line of money. You need that money no matter what. So ono, bringing Ono Satoshi was like, uh, like a <laughs> you, <laughs> uh, very practical. Great way to bring in the money. <laughs>。Don't write this on Twitter. This is New York exclusive information. Um, but the second reason I, is I also worked with Ono Satoshi before previously, and we were discussing about the possibility of working with him on this. At the time, it was called the Iga no Kuni project. Uh, and so that's how it happened. He's quite good in the uh, knife fight with uh, Ryohei Suzuki. He's a genius. The character Hebe had three months of practice. <laughs> you, as you see in the film, he doesn't really, Hebe's character doesn't really have action scenes before that scene. 
もう初めからいろんなアクションをやってるから最後の川っていうリバーっていうのをやるのはだから鈴木亮平が平米が3か月ぐらいで大野君は多分20日間ぐらいですねあれ覚えたのは。や,や,るや,るやろうっていう話はずっとしてます。Yes, はい、absolutely. We've always been speaking to do another future one. <笑> Great.、Uh, do we have any、uh, hands、uh, towards the back? I want to make sure I don't miss anyone. I see one here on the side.、Uh, hi,、uh, I'm a big fan from China.、Um, I, wor I work here and I.、Uh, I just want to thank you so much for so many great movies、uh, you bring to us. And I'm a big fan of、uh, Ono Satoshi Kun. And also,、uh, uh, of course, you as well. <laughs>、um, uh, because I know you already made a lot of movies from、uh, Isaka Kotaro Kun, the writer.、Uh, so a lot of movies w a s made from the novels he w r i t e、um, So I just want to know.、Uh, Is there any characteristics from、uh, like Ono Satoshi Kun or Isaka Kotaro Kun's novel that you really appreciate?、Uh, the, that the thing you want to bring to your audience? So, is, that, is there any like magic from them <laughs> that you want to, to share with us? Isaka s a n wa. なんて言ったらいいのかな僕と伊坂さんの好きな映画監督が一緒だったりとか映画作品が一緒だったりとかあと生まれてる年も一つ違いだしうんやりたいことが一緒なんですよねうんなんかなんて言えばいいのかな。So,、mm. Mr. Isaka and I have very similar tastes in film. We like the same movies and the same directors, and we're also only one year apart. So, the, the things that we want to work on are usually very similar. The most important thing is that 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 the most important thing is かなもうストレートに悲しませないというか悲しいシーンこそ笑いを入れたりなんかそういう、うん、そ,のそんな感じかな。うん、so I would say the, the interesting points of, of Isaka are different for each、um, film or each work,、um, but one、uh, underlying factor is that sadness is not straightforward. There is a chance to have laughter or a little bit of humor in that sadness, the sad scenes. Ono Kun was, I was in the middle of the offer, and I was in the middle of the offer, and I was in the middle of the offer. So, I was in the middle of the offer, and I was in the middle of the offer, and I was in the middle of the offer. Uh, as for Ono Satoshi,、um, Mumon always seemed to be an on Ono Satoshi character. The times when he's not battling, the character seems like Ono Satoshi. <laughs> Mumon.、Mm -hmm. Great. Uh, more uh, questions uh, from our audience?、Uh, we have one over here, and then we'll go over here afterwards towards the center. If you could raise your hand again. Great. Thank you so much for coming to New York. I, we I really enjoyed the movie, especially after such a long day. This comedic movie really brightened up my whole day.、Um, but I was wondering if you could share like, maybe one of your favorite moments or stories from behind the scenes while filming this movie, since it seems like the cast really had a fun time filming this.
暑かったんですよ、本当に。Really えー、今,今頃撮ってたんですよ、今頃クランクインして、で日本にはあの長野県というところがあって、えー、トロントとかが近いのかな、あのあの気候は。だからの7月、8月っていうのはすっごい暑いところでずっと撮影して戦になったらその長野県っていう涼しいところで撮ってたんで戦になったら楽だからって言ってみんなで辛い日々を送ったのを思い出しますね、えー、あの下山砦っていう冒頭のシーンとかは動物園みたいな匂いになっちゃって、えー、本当、男たちの。本当もうすごい匂いがしてました。<笑>すいません。It was just extremely hot. We had crank in around July to August, and the Shimo Yama Toride no scene, the scene with the, all of the men, it was really, it smelled like a zoo. It was extremely, the odor was incredible, but we kept telling each other just wait until we can shoot in Nagano, which is like same temperature as Canada, so it will be cooler then. 10日間ぐらい撮影してたんですけどあの下山鳥りがあの人間って汗かくと塩を吹くじゃないですか。So the, the, the shooting for this really hot scene was 10 days and once people sweat, the salt is on your skin. でみんなブラックのねみんな黒なんで everyone is wearing black. みんな塩を吹いてたんで。And everyone has salt. <笑>それを隠すために砂をこうまぶして、全員全員まぶして、全員まぶして、全員まぶして、全員まぶして、全員まぶして、全員まぶして、全員まぶして、全員まぶして、That you're just dying to cover.、Uh, for example, Johnny Toe desperately wanted to make a musical, so he did.、Um, so, is there something that you'd really love to do that you haven't yet been able to do? So, this is. I don't know. I don't know. あのー、毎回ジャンルが違うじゃないですか。Uh, me, だから、僕だからこそ、でもやっぱりこれだけはやりたいっていうのが、多分もうすぐ見つかりそうな気がするので。同じように、なんか好きっていうことに対して、なんか、うん、譲れない、他とは譲れない、絶対これが好きだっていうような、何かにすごいあの夢中になってる人の話はやりたいですね。One thing I do want to shoot is someone who is really passionate and into something and who has complete、um, focus on one thing. He wants to focus on someone like that in his next film. Great.、Um, I think we have time for about two more questions.、Uh, so if anyone has any, one or two more questions, if anyone has a question, <laughs> up towards the front. Hi, it's here. Thank you. Thank you for the film. I have a question about the character of Hebe. So he said he grew up with his father in the, the town of Ninja, and his father, who was one of the council of the twelve, right? I was wondering why he is so special. He has the humanity. Do you, would you,、uh, do you intend to imply something specific through the character? That's my question. Thank you. あれ僕,僕らもちょっといろいろ疑問で<笑> We also discussed a lot about that. 多分,多分あの忍者って他の国で雇われて
長い間潜入したり忍び込んだりとかしてやっていくからそれが長くて帰ってきてすぐっていう設定ではありますね。うん Uh, the scenario for his character is that he was out、uh, on many expeditions and had just come back. So he had just arrived, and this is what he came to. He was out on many expeditions and had just come back. So he had just arrived, and this is what he came to. There was a scene where he, said, he comes back and he says, What are you guys doing? But we cut that in, in the editing. もし次の機会あれば、えー、と小野さんと一緒にお仕事をしたいんですか<笑>したいですよ。自分の持ってる企画とか物語で例えばそうだな。あのさっきあ映画で出たみたいな「こなす」っていうあのティーうんあるでしょああいうそういうお茶の道具のお話の例えば映画だとしたら大野君お茶のああいう,そうお茶碗とかお茶,お茶の世界茶道ねで興味あるって聞いたりはし,しますよ。そういういのいここキャンペーンとかでずっと一緒だったからなんか企画の話は聞きますよあのここで俺と大野んで手組んじゃえば会社会社はうなずくんじゃないかと思ってそういうのはやってますね、ええ、So there's not one specific role I would like Ono to play but for example the tea caddy that comes up in the film I, on set, I would ask him, so Ono, what do you think about learning like, tea ceremony and being in a film about like, tea? And so、uh, director Nakamura thinks if he can partner with Ono here on set with Ono, then the uppers will agree to working with him again. So he was asking him many questions on set. So, what do you think about this? What do you think about that?、Mm. Great. So、uh, before we move on to the party part of the evening,、um, just as a final question, I know we broke about 95 degrees here in New York today, but would you consider New York as a potential shooting location for the next film? No, thank you. トロントとかそういう。In Toronto カラッとカラッとしたところで。Really crisp. That would be nice.、Yeah. Okay. 秋は秋は,秋はどうですかね。Or in autumn. Autumn would be nice. Okay. Yeah, we have all seasons. Great, great, great. <laughs> Uh, st we still have all seasons for now.、Yeah. Great.、Um, so、uh, please join me in giving a final round of applause for director Nakamura. Thank you. <laughs>